I've read in the newspapers that I'm very nervous. I wasn't aware of that. Perhaps you're right. I don't think it's, that's correct. Why? Because together with my team here, and you can see what kind of people is surrounding me and supporting me and helping me, I am very confident about tomorrow's election. <coughs> I am always the man who has confidence. No. Like M. Platini? I have a, oh, but I am a winner. He's not. <laughs> you know, I am a winner. I win a lot of World Cup, a lot of tournaments. Yeah. He's not. And also, I don't, I, I don't work for a job. I don't ask for a job. Yeah. No, he has a job already. I, no, I start to, to support Johans before everything mm -hmm. because I like his program. You know? I like democracy, I like opening to, to, to discuss the problem of the sport. Mm -hmm. That's the reason, it's different, different vision, you know? Uh, people talk about change. No. Why they didn't change before? Mm -hmm. Why? Because we start to talk about change now, you know, the program that Johansson started, mm -hmm. then everybody starts to talk about yeah, change, yeah. but now it's too late. <laughs> I would not go into just an adventure uh, because uh, I have too much respect uh, for the FIFA, uh, for the FIFA family composed by the national associations and the confederations, uh, just uh, to be a hazardeur uh, and a gambler. Uh, this was never my case and will never be the case and that's why I'm confident going tomorrow morning in this uh, election. For me, uh, I think Blatter will be the best choice of African football. But I don't know other people's opinion. Everybody has their own uh, opinion. It's a cosa que no respetamos la independencia, la autonomía de todas las federaciones internacionales. Estoy seguro que tomarán la mejor decisión y las relaciones entre el Comité Olímpico y la FIFA se quedarán al mismo nivel que hasta ahora.